Uh, hi, Joe. Uh, okay, so in order to uh, calculate this, <clears throat> first off, as of right now, there is now a sale. 20.24% off until January 15th. Um, so, um, the only way to get that pricing is to pay for the sanctuary in full on the website. Um, to make a deposit, you're not going to get the sale price. Okay, so that said, here's what we're going to do. Now, if you want it to look like this, then here's what we need to do. Go to this one first, and uh, you'll notice that the base price is regularly just under 3000 Currently, it is more than $210 off just the canopy tree. <clears throat> so, height is going to be 72 to get it to be look like this. It's going to be 72, diameter 24, bottom shape has the flared bottom that's this lower area, how it gets wider. Um, and let's see, uh, this is going to be this size here. Four lounge pads is what is shown here. Uh, next, the trunk top, which is this, well, it's kind of hard to see in this picture, but there's an area right where the trunk ends and the branches begin. Most people go with the uh, this one here, curved bed trunk top. What it gives you an, is a nice curvature that your cats can lay down in between the branches. Um, there's also an option for doing a, a tunnel that goes on an angle from the third floor here right up to the back of that. Okay, there's 10 inch diameter tunnel and 12 inch diameter tunnel and there's also an option for doing a tunnel plus a small curved bed in the front of that. Um, so, you know, you're going to make your choices based on what your interest is, <clears throat> but bear in mind that uh, the price goes up when you, you know, let's say, for example, you want uh, the tunnel with the curved bed, that's 300 If you wanted just the tunnel, that's 200 so that's 100 bucks more for the uh, uh, adding the curved bed in the front. And if you wanted just a simple trunk top with a curved bed, that's only $80. It should be more, but it's only $80. So let's say you're going with that one, because that's what I actually did on that guy's tree. <coughs> um, so here, um, I'm going going to go ahead and, uh, by the way, and any warnings that come on to my website are just because I haven't renewed my SSL certificate for a couple of years. And so Google like automatically tells people, hey, this isn't secure, but you know there's no bugs or viruses on my website that I'm aware of. Um, anyway, I'm gonna probably be working on getting that SSL certificate done fairly soon. I think GoDaddy has those, uh, and then this kind of warning stuff won't even occur. But just for the sake of uh, completing the form, I'm gonna go ahead and say 35. Uh, by, you know, let's say 80 inches for the height. Again, this this is um, for, you know, to ensure your tree will fit into your house. This is basically about your doorways. You know, whatever doorways and hallways and stairways that you're going to have to navigate to get the large canopy tree into your home. That's what this is about. So 34 inch width by 80 inch height. I'm going to write there. You can, you know, write whatever you want there up to 100 characters, but that's what it's supposed to be for. Okay, balconies. Now, on this tree that you're seeing in this picture, there's one, two, three balconies. So that's why I'm picking three. Now, a lot of people just go with the one because you don't really need them down here. You know, one in front looks really wonderful. If you want all three, that's going to be additional cost. So look at the differences in price. One balcony only is 150 versus 450 if you want all three. So if you do want it to look like the photo, and I'll assume that you do, we'll put that in. 
So trunk texture, folds in the carpet, is all those really nice folds. Uh, this one might show it better. Yeah. See how the uh, folds look really nice? You know about the folds, and that's, there, that's a better illustration of the trunk. Now, if you wanted to add mushrooms, let me know. I'm going to actually add that to the listing because, you know, it's a neat feature and it's not currently available in the listing itself. Um, so anyway, uh, also if you wanted to get multicolored wisteria, that's an option that's available. If you wanted it to be like purple tones like this, like let's pretend purple's your favorite color, um, you could get it like this as well. Um, in fact, these options are already available in the listing and multicolored wisteria is available in the listing. So, uh, back to here, tree trunk color, um, dark speckled as shown. There's a little bit of an upcharge because Shaw Carpet Industries has discontinued that carpet and there's a limited supply of it left. Um, I have enough to do a few more of these trees and then there's enough at the warehouse that I go to to do several more, but when it's gone, it's gone. And then I'm going to have to find something very similar uh, to replace it. Okay, so tree pads color, we'll say olive green. Um, now, I'm actually ending up these days paying extra to buy that special order, and it's like about 30 bucks a yard. So I may be adding cost for, for the greens um, because of the fact that I'm having to pay extra instead of buying them at remnant prices. Um, base color, moss green. That's what we're seeing here, moss green. And moss green is a, kind of a generic term I'm using. Sometimes it's more of a peridot. Sometimes it's more light. Um, you know, so they do kind of vary a little bit. Um, but, you know, whenever I do an order for you, I'll make sure all three of your bases have the same green. Okay, so next. Um, okay, so moss patches and stones on the base. Now this actually has dense moss and um, I'm gonna say th three stones probably um, let's see so that is here okay so that is dense moss three stones and for the canopy tree there's not a whole lot of surface area outside of the tree to do a lot of moss patches <coughs> that's why it's a little bit less money than uh, some of the other items that have a lot more surface area for that. So if you go with dense moss on like say the tree stump module or the log and tree perch, it's gonna be more pricey than 120. All right, so draping moss, we're gonna do draping moss on tree pads and balconies. That's what's shown here, balconies, tree pads. All right, um, again, you know that's that's an upcharge because it's a it's a lot of material and, and, and work to do that so that's three hundred dollars to add that okay draping moss color green now if you like I said before if you wanted to do lavender or gray those are available I do have other colors available you know upon request if they exist and I can get them you know uh, I'd be happy to do that probably just have to charge a little extra to buy the material because you can only buy it by the yard all right, climbing vines. Uh, what's shown on that tree is English ivy and white flowers. And then for uh, draping wisteria, that's purple. So that's a little pricey because it's a lot of work. Just so you know, I have to kitty proof all of these flowers, which means I hot glue every single flower. And I'm not talking one, two, three. No. These long ones have like over 30 flowers that I hot glue. So that has to be done in order to make those so that the, you know they don't drop flowers all over the place. And I don't want your cats grabbing them with their teeth and plucking flowers off. So it's next to impossible for the cats to damage the wisteria unless they actually chew on it like crazy. Then they might bite off a section of it because it is only plastic. You know, where, 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 where all the green areas that connect all the flowers to the wire above is just plastic. And it's relatively thin. So if you do have chewing cats, you might want to not go with wisteria. Um, so next, 
we got uh, hanging toys that's an option if you wanted to add toys um, also these toys are going to be just cheapo toys that I get for five bucks you know or sell for five dollars things like glitter pom-poms um, for mini mice you know maybe the rattle type uh, they're kind of like loud colors like lime green and orange and hot pink and like a bright blue uh, and a yellow uh, also I think there are white and then I have some that uh, are black fur and white fur but those are those are natural fur so they tend to like a rab old rabbit pelt wear out over time so I would yeah but if you want to get uh, toys um, in addition to what you're seeing here um, that's an option so you would just pick no toy um, you can go into the accessories tab after you order and uh, pick these individually you know um, some of these I may be just out of stock on like see like this one out of stock I think I may be out on this one you know there's now you can actually go in here and if you're doing it on a PC it's a lot easier you can go into hanging cat toys and select insect toys or nat nature cat toys um, and that's gonna show you know the things like the hummingbird uh, this cute little caterpillar guy this one is actually out of stock but I can get more easily um, you know there's a lot of different stuff uh, but if you wanted to specifically look at the insect ones like bugs there you go now you're just looking at the stuff that is bug themed so you would buy these individually and then maybe in special requests say oh can you please hang the toys I bought you know on my sanctuary in various areas and I'll know that you know because you'll talk to me we'll, we'll discuss it okay so that's that um, and so uh, that's where we're at on that so you don't have to put a quantity one um, but just for the sake of creating this mock-up order I'm going to say add to cart now notice the special price 5622 for the canopy tree regular price 6229 so you know pretty good size difference in price you're saving uh, somewhere around what f almost four hundred dollars and I'd have to do the math but looking at it, it looks like uh, no, actually, it's, uh, it's about six hundred dollars. Yeah, so that's a big, big savings just on the canopy tree. But again, you would have to pay for it in full. All right. So. Okay, so, so far we've got the canopy tree now with all the itemization. It doesn't show all the special, you know, the, all the different upcharge costs in the shopping cart, um, but that is the grand total for just the canopy tree. So then what you do is go continue shopping and go into the modular collection once again. Now, if you want it to look like this, we'll do this one next. Okay? So that one that you're seeing in this picture is the same exact one that's in that photo with the three of them together with the green window panes. So if you want to make it look like this, that's dense moss. Now, I don't recommend going with dense. That's a little crazy. You don't really need it that dense. And I think it honestly looks a little better when it's not so patchy like that. So when it comes to that section, I'm going to do that as sparse moss. Okay, so diameter, this one is a 16 inch diameter and it's a 53 inch height. Um, wait a second, this might be a 64. Let's see, because it's got a, a doorway here, a doorway here. That means it's got three interior floors, including the bottom floor. So I think this is a 64. Um, this one may have been made at a time where I didn't have the uniform uh, um, standard heights which are 42, 53, 64 uh, and then it goes up past six feet tall um, so uh, this one was probably 60 inch height which really made it so that 
the three floors were really sandwiched quite badly and they were only 10 inch height. So in order to give your cats 11 to 12 inch or more, it's uh, that's why I have the new standard sizes. Okay, so 16 inch diameter. The height is going to be, if you want, with uh, three interior levels, um, that's going to be, uh, this will give you two interior. So that's probably enough, but if you wanted to go with the 64 inch height, we could do that. Right now I'm going to say we're doing this one. That'll give you a uh, bottom level plus one level, and then this level plus this. And a lot of times what I've been doing in the last year or so is putting one of these tree fungus steps on the opposite side of here. And I can show you that real fast. Um, get off that it just goes away so you have to kind of go over and then down all right so um, this one shows it here see how I got that on the back side here let's blow it up yeah that was that way there your cat can actually lay through this little threshold and be on one big surface it makes it the size of this so we don't need three in front now you can add more and make it you know more of a spiral kind of a thing and if you want to add a mushroom or two we can do that as well uh, this one shown is a chanted garden um, here's another one this is a 42 inch height with the same effect see we got this making one big surface and most cats don't really have a problem laying their belly over this little threshold uh, it's still quite comfortable so, um, back to this. <clears throat> Alright, so there's our heights, number of tree fungus steps. Let's pretend we're just going to go with three. Alright, so three, and there's no extra charge for that. If you did want to add, make a fourth one, it would be an extra 50, or extra two for 100. Okay, let's just pretend we're going to go with the extra one. Alright, so main color is going to be dark speckled, unless you want to change that. Uh, driftwood shag, unless you want to change it. Um, the base, moss green. Outer texture, folded. No roots. Moss patches or stones. Let's go with the uh, sparse moss and three stones. Alright draping moss. We're going to do that because that is here. Alright. Next. Color. Green. Um, climbing vines. If you wanted to do this again, that's $80 on a stump. And pedestals. That basically means mushrooms. I'm going to change that on here. I, just, I changed it on most of the listings. Some of them I've forgotten. But if you wanted to add a mushroom here, a mushroom there, whatever, if you wanted one or two mushrooms with size of rope on that, we can do that. So uh, I'm going to assume you don't want it, um, but just to show you, uh, each one is like $80 roughly. So, well, actually that's, you know, they should be more, but at this point they're 80 bucks a piece. So if you wanted to add one, then you would, and then you're going to have to pay extra to have rope on the stem. So I'm just going to assume that, well, you know what, let's just do it for fun, for just a second. Alright, size of color, uh, let's pretend we're going to go natural. So natural, no dye, that way there you don't pay extra money for uh, doing dye. Now then you have to do the covering. Now, if you say carpet only, there's no extra cost. If you add rope, the size of rope, it's $25. So you got $25. Now if you wanted this to be a color, for example purple, you're going to pay an extra $25 for the dye, dyeing of the rope. The black costs more because to get a true black is you have to dye it two times. So you have to dye it, let it dry completely, and then dye it again. Otherwise it comes out midnight blue. So, um, again, I'm going to just get rid of this now because I just wanted to show it to you. So toadstools not included. No toadstools. Alright. 
by the time you place your order it may say mushrooms <laughs> um, so uh, size okay so we're gonna say again not included all right we're gonna say no toys because we already considered the idea of putting those into uh, um, into you know shopping cart for ordering special toys all right so now this one's substantially lower Notice the regular price is twelve fifty four versus eleven forty six. So you're saving over a hundred and ten about a hundred and eight dollars, well, about a hundred and seven dollars on that one if you're able to pay all in full on the website. So again, you don't have to put this in. So now we've got the stump. Where did the other one? shouldn't have gone anywhere. Unless I did on here, I accidentally don't think so. One second. Alright, I'm going to have to talk to my web developer um, because uh, the shopping cart's not functioning cor correctly. It seems like it clears um, when, when, whenever you have a second item that you create, it clears the shopping cart of the first one. So, I'm going to have to work with you on this until I get that repaired. Um, so, next one is going to be the enchanted log and tree purchase that's the one that you want from the photo um, and this right here is that so again you don't really need all this crazy denseness of moss uh, to me that kind of looks like an aerial view of like uh, Iowa <laughs> um, but anyway let's see um, so this log is a 14 inch with just a hole in the top so that is here. All right, and uh, the color dark speckled. Uh, base again moss green. Log texture folded. Okay, uh, moss patches and stones on the base. We'll go with sparse again and three stones. Okay, so draping moss. That's for around those two trees. And. Color again, all green. Um, <clears throat> uh, now, if you want to add rope, like on these two, has the rope. You can do it one or both. And then that's going to be dark brown. It comes out looking a little bit on the purplish side, but uh, that's a hard thing to do with dyeing rope to get a true brown. I can do a better job if you like, though, if you don't like that purplish tone. All right, so no toys, and uh, there's our pricing there. So, log and tree. I'm writing this down since it's not allowing it to be all added into the cart. So I'm going to pause this and give you a total price. Okay, calculations are complete. Um, so, regular price for all three of these items as we've created them would be $8,827. With the sale, it would be $7,931.02. Um, since we can't really do it on the website, um, I would have to uh, do something like send you an invoice uh, with authorized.net or split this into payments now I'd be willing to do that for you and give you the sale price um, if we could do say a 20% deposit um, if you just want to do a 10% deposit the price is going to be the 8827 um, so you know if you wanted to do that get this going or if you want to scale it back a little bit let's say your maximum uh, desired expenditure is like 6500 or even 6000 um, we can scale it back with some of the options to get it a little bit lower in cost um, but honestly for a three-piece module set including uh, a canopy tree there's just no way to do it for under five uh, unless it was so bare bones that it wasn't even going to be to your liking that much but uh, Typically, three, uh, a, a, just a canopy tree in a very, very basic version 
starts around uh, I'm gonna say three thousand to four thousand. So you know the one that we're gonna be doing that is in the photo, as you saw it, um, as you saw it in this photo here, um, that's got a lot of extras. So it's got you know all this folds in it. It's got the bottom shape. It's got the three balconies. It's got all the flowers on it everywhere. It's got all the faux fur, um, you know, dense moss and stones on the base, you know, and the little curved bed on the top. So there's even stuff that we could do to make it even more uh, intricate, but that would even increase the price further. So I'm not sure what your max budget is on this, but um, like I said, I'd be willing to give you the sale price if I can get a deposit uh, before the 15th. Okay? So there you go.